Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. We've got a 50 over game, Omaru versus Lumsden. Okay. Now, 50 over games have not been our speciality so far. So let's hope this time we have a bit more success. It's, yeah, it's not been... It's not been great. It's not been great. I think, yeah, our high score is still about 30 or so in a one-day game. We're yet to hit a half century, so that should that's the aim. But whether it happens or not, we'll have to wait and see. I have just been absolutely moosing the ball. Uh, in the last match I played, so hopefully, like it wasn't a career game, it was like playing as Australia. So I hope, you know, hopefully I don't go for anything too silly out the bat, and um, fine. But let's wait and see. We are going to be chasing, which is good. We've not already led a successful one day chase so it'll be good to have a chance to do that the pitch is very dark like the lighting is incredibly dull um that looked like a decent score we're going to be chasing here our average is up to 40 tuggy is 307 okay well let's see if we can make some inroads i guess yep. it's just a single to get off the mark Love to see it. Sorry, like, I don't know why some pitches are as dark as they are, because this one is, like, pitch black. Alright, so Pyra saw out the rest of the over and didn't score a run. It's not really the start we needed. That's nicely into the gap. Should be back for two. I forgot how slow we are at running, but... Whew. That would have been close on a direct hit. Like, really quite close. There's a big gap straight. If he goes full, maybe we try to moose it over his head. Ooh. Oh, no, 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 no. That guy fielded it well. I didn't realize quite how close to him it had gone. And now they've put the man in there as well for the moose that I just went for. On top of the bounce, but just a single. Couldn't... I mean, it's quite hard to, you know, when they've got two people back in that side, it was almost impossible to go for. Yeah, look. Look at this protection. There's leg side protection. What's this? They know it's our only scoring shot. No. I'm, I'm trying to hit it straight, and he's just nerdling it to that guy there. And now they've moved the field around. There's a little bit of a gap there. Or the drive is the probably the other option. Nice, 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 nice. On top of that one from the get-go, pushed it away. Bang. Yeah, love to see it. Now the gap's opened up there. Pull in the field all around at the moment. Uh, a little bit too straight. Not quite through the covers, but it's the right kind of shot. It's crazy how much less power I feel like I have batting now in the career mode than playing as, like, David Warder. Yes. Like, I just am not... <laughs> the ball just doesn't travel anywhere near as far or as fast, so... that's It's good that, you know, it's a noticeable difference. Especially considering my guy is a batsman, he's got all of his bonus skills in batting traits. But because we're not, like, actually leveled up or very high there, then we can't do the same stuff. Unless it's the leg glance that we've perfected. <laughs> Good though, Pyra's not quite not in the rhythm yet, so... No, that's fine though, we're... We're round about the run rate, 19 from three overs. Ooh, mistimed that, but we should get back for at least two. Not four. Oh, no. Okay, I'm not going to go 
Should have gone for the third because the guy scuffed up his catch, but fine. Two runs is all good. trying to put it in the gap between the two of them but it's such a narrow gap like having the two men back on the leg side like that is very anti our strategy for scoring like that's where we've scored most of our runs in the career mode if there was like a, a wagon wheel for the entire career we'd have a load of drives and a load of leg glances so they seem to have learned Lumsden have been uh, watching our tape Still getting some fours though. Still getting some runs through the drive. That's a nice little glance, but again, the man's there. They've been studying. Now they've proper packed this. How many people are there for the drive? I want to step across almost. What is that? How are you catching that? That is... What an insane catch! Oh, come on. I even said there's so many people there for the drive and I just went for it anyway. And we were all out for 190. I still ended with the third highest score of the team, and I didn't do anything, really. All out in 41 overs. That was dreadful. What are we doing? What are we doing? Anyway, club three-day game. Cromwell versus Omaru. We're away at Komaru. Yeah, I knew the 50 overs. We were not. We were not winning. Fourth place. Fair enough. All right, away at Cromwell. Let's see how we go. Two chances of batting, obviously. Um, the, this video will probably only have the first innings, uh, unless we absolutely fail, which there's quite a high chance that might happen. So I wouldn't be too worried about this. Um, let's let's see how we do. Although to be fair, our three day form has been a lot better than one day, and like we're still struggling in the one day games. That was. That's an annoying, annoying way to get out, though, man. Like we were timing the ball well. We even timed that one really well. Just the man was there. We've been caught there, I think, three times? Oh, they had a bit of a collapse. They had a bit of a collapse there. Let's just have a quick look at their scorecard. Yeah, look at that. 112 from the opening batsman and then nothing like no one down the order contributed at all five wickets for Kuman, four for james look at that five for 34 from 19 overs he had a beautiful day and there was a run out as well yeah good old garogo all right so they've got the man back there but we've still got huge gaps on the leg side to aim for if they stray or we can go for a drive on the up first ball. It's a brave strategy, I will admit. Oh, we're back to face... Look, so the last few times we were batting number two. And I'm assuming that's because of our performances. We've now been pushed back up to number one. So we face the first ball. Are they going to reach that? They are. It's the free runs there. Nicely done. Welcome the new batsmen, the captain. And we are obviously uh, improving enough that the team are happy to have us right at the top. I didn't change any settings, it automatically had put me there. Hey. Yo, I... He swung it away. Because he's coming, what, right... Yeah, he's right arm round. So I was assuming if he's bowling there, it's going to come in slightly, but... Well bowled. He could have been cleaned up. No, wait. Oh, it's just gone. Ball, oh, okay. I thought the man had got the ball, but he dived straight over it here. No! 
Oh, the gaps there for the leg glance. Our favourite shot if they do stray there. Gonna leave that one well alone. No point going for a cut or something when you got four or five slips in. Are there three slips in the gully? Yeah. No point looking for anything that reckless. Wait on. Oh. <laughs> yes. Oh no, we're out, we're out, we're out. Oh, we missed. We would have been so gone. We would have been gone by a country mile. Oh lordy, we got lucky there. Alright, Pyro is just facing a load of dot balls, that's fine. I think that's in the gap enough, wow. No dive from him. After missing that previous one, he didn't even go for it. See, we're, we're offering offering a chance that we can get them an edge. So they're keeping the ball out there, but the man's now in close on the drive. I see that, so I'm not going to... Oh, well worked. It's gone. It's, it's gone over the boundary. Somehow we got enough on this one. Yeah, the man, this man here that I'm pointing my aimer at is the the danger man. Oh, what a beautiful straight drive! Eddie Eagle feeling in top form this morning, and they are bowling it nice and full. Bang! 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 Three fours in a row. What else has Utapa got? Oh, that was a little bit risky with a man there on the drive, but it's another four. We're not, not leaving anything in the locker here. This is a very solid start. <laughs> 28 from 11 balls. Yeah, yeesh. Not sure about that one. You know, that's why they keep bowling it though. There's a chance that we're going to get an edge and uh, be gone. That one's a little bit too wide. Not worth going for because the chances of us edging it pretty high. Pretty high. I know myself and I know that I would probably have edged it. Oh, that was close to the man. I think they've got that man that we got out to in the last innings. He's there. He's waiting. And luckily, we just got it around him. An interesting tactic, though. That, like, coming... Uh... Oh, no, it's left arm. I'm sure in his warm-up, he was right arm. Or was that the other bowler? It might have been the other bowler. Um... But anyway, look at this. Another foolish ball smack. Up to 36 from 15. Big gaps on the leg side. Some safety here and there. No, we can't let some balls go. Can't be, can't be carting every single one. When the spinners come on, that we really have trouble. Ooh, I say as I completely whiff it. <laughs> ah, it's fine. It's fine. No danger here. No, no, no. Nothing like that. Wait, yeah. No. We oh. really didn't time that ball at all. Okay. Thirty-six from eighteen. That one though is too straight. I think that's two. Forget how slow we are, but we should get back. Yeah. Easy to. Uh-oh. Well, we've lost Pyra already, which is not a good sign, because he's been probably the top scorer for the team, I would have thought. So, more pressure on us. It's okay, though. We're, we're feeling in form. We are <laughs> timing the ball, and it is travelling. Um, 
Utapa has not had a good time against us. He's going for more than 10 runs and over at the moment. Yep. And that's only increasing. <laughs> Bye. The favoured shot, man. That There's so many times that we've got the runs there. If they go straight, we've got two options, really. That was a bit uppish, so quite close to that man in close. Oh, you know, I've got to remember he's there. Like I can't see him, but that's 50 in 22 balls. 11 fours. See, that, that guy in close there. He, there's a chance he pulls out some superhero dive, but... We are flying, like, all oh my days. Waiting. Like that. That's what I need to worry about, because if I hit it slightly uppish, he's just like... Like the flash, like, so fast. Oh, the bowler maybe had a chance there. Not a good shot. Not a good shot. But yeah, very packed offside field here. 7 2. Wait on. And again, another pants drive. End of the over. The batting side are now on 54 for 1. So the highlights of our innings has basically been drives at the moment. A couple of glances, but lots of drives. Lots of these well-timed, but yeah, it's just drive after drive. Look, see? What did I... Look at that! <laughs> what a, I mean, the straight drive was absolutely beautiful. There's only been one glance, and the rest has just been bang, bang, bang. You're bowling it full and outside off, so we're just hitting it. Interesting. An interesting start. So they brought a new bowler on, who's now right arm over. Which does mean the glance is opened up a little bit more. Waiting. And the man has come out of that close spot. That's like, that's the main thing I need to check for in these fields. Because if the guy is here, the drive is suddenly l a lot more dangerous. Yes. It's quite a good field to us. Like, there's a... Having just that little bit extra cover on the leg side means it's a lot harder for us to hit the glances and And now we have some wrist spin and now things could take a horrible turn. I was so late on the ball. Don't wanna let him settle into his rhythm though, going after him from the first. And we've cleared it. Over the cover, over the cover bound, or well, into the cover boundary. He's bowling it so wide, so. Like, you could go for a late cut, but the keeper's just gonna superhero reflex. Oh my. That was a, that was a, like, good length. I didn't really know what shot to play there. Oh, I've skewed that. I was aiming right, like, straight down. Like a big moose. Probably slightly on the onside. But a little bit skewed and somehow it's made, made it up and over the guys. Hey, good ball. Well, we're having some success and an equal amount of failure at the moment. I think that's enough. Yeah, just avoided him. So that was three fours and three mooses and misses. But they're bowling it wide there. They haven't got anyone back. As long as we get some, like, okay. This angle is much more awkward. Like, that, that's the angle that I bowl. Um, but I'm left-handed, so obviously I'm bowling it to a right armor. And if they pitch it like on off stump. No! Oh, throw! Oh, fielding from the deep there! Change of bowling. The right armor is coming into the attack. Okay, and then a new pace bowler. So the other guy wasn't on for very long. 
Oh, this is one of the opening bowlers back. Yes. Single. Okay. Scoring has definitely slowed down since we hit the 50. Um, apart from, obviously, the absolute moves against this guy. Which, if he basically does a full toss, then it's a free shot. There's no, there's no way I'm not hitting it there. <laughs> oh, there's no chance of that ball spinning and getting in the way. Free to have a go at. That's a good ball. We've still managed to somehow get enough on it. I don't think it's going though. Nope. Flicked back. Nicely done. The two. Okay. Okay. Where right, are we going? So tempted to just try to moose him into cow corner, but... Oh, I've got it. And we've not really connected, but I think we connected enough. It's just outrunning the fielder. That would be such an annoying one. Because you're like just a bit far, just a bit too far away to like field it and catch it, and then it just keeps running and running and running. They need to ball a little bit wider. Get it, get it, get it, get it. No way. Just kicks on. Now they've got the men back. There's an easy single if we can just drive it. That's what we do. We've pushed the fielders back. Keep rotating the strike. Take the easy runs where we got them. There we go. I said the plan was not to let him settle. And he's not been able to yet. It is up to 78. The rest of our team have scored six runs. The rest of our... The rest... Ah. Okay, and now there's a wide on the board as well. In 14 overs... The rest of the team has scored six runs. I mean, I've faced... I've, I've only faced half the balls. I've faced less than half the balls. Leo has got two from 33 balls. Didn't time that very well. I don't think it's going to go to the boundary. We should get back for two. Yeah. Um, so while he's obviously struggling, for whatever reason, Leo's not not best comfortable on the pitch. But we found our form, that's for sure. Oh, get out of here! Six, I think. We're proper connected. Hundred run partnership, I guess. Are we not going to see a replay? Oh, what? Was it a six? I don't even know. What happened? Like. Proper moosed it. Did it go? Oh yeah, that's going. Oh no. Oh, it's so close. Oh woman, watch out. <laughs> Good shot though. No real danger because there wasn't anyone back at that point. And then there's the gap, which we're not really timed. Might run away. <laughs> that's us into the 90s. I wonder what it what is it about the free day games that I find so much more I like I seem to struggle so much less. Yep, yep. Uh oh. This is a dangerous dive. Now I really struggled in the nineties before. The la the last innings I forgot how to hit the ball. Um Let's hope that doesn't happen again. We're not going to go for any silly shots in the 90s. It's fine. Like we've, we've done the hard work getting up to this point. Just make it slow. Utapa's back. His awkward angle. However, he's bowled it a bit too straight. We haven't got the timing down, but a good shot right between the fielders. And that has taken us to 98. I kind of like the idea, bowling short. Oh, the fields come in for the single, but if they stray too straight, there's an easy boundary. 
which I probably could have gone for. Okay. 98. It up ish. Timing's off. Ooh, pressure on. Hands are getting sweaty. Mistimed it. Back for the second. And that is the sentry. Eddie the Eagle completes yet another sentry. Oh, fantastic. I think that's our third sentry. 24s. One of them was very close to being a six. Just over an hour. Short celebration, because we want a double sentry. We want a massive score. Yes. We've really mistimed it, but we hoofed it enough. We should get back for two. Oh, it's gone all the way. Who cares? You know, we mistimed it, but that doesn't matter. We're in. We're feeling it. And Bob. <laughs> I did not connect with that one at all. It's fine though. It's fine. The rest of the team needs to do something though. Like, jeez. No one else is scoring any runs. And I've only faced, yeah, what, 51 balls. Some highlights of the century. Careful. Okay, so from the 50, that looks a lot nicer. It's spread out a little bit. We've got a bit more leg side. We've got no cuts or anything like that, which is probably for the best, you know? They've had lots of slips in, so why would we go for anything like that? So very straight, and then anything, anything that they've bowled too straight, we have taken advantage of as well. A spinner's in. Slog is still on. We've not really timed it. I think that might be it. That is. But another century there for Eddie the Eagle. It's going to bring to an end this quite long episode. And next time, see how we do. See how we do in the second innings. Will we be ahead? Will the rest of the team pull through? Find out next time. A shame. 106, 52 balls. A good innings. A good innings.